the night before Christmas, when all through the house not a creature was stirring, not even a mouse. The stockings were hung by the chimney with care, in hopes that St. Nicholas soon would be there. Children were all next and snug in their beds, while Deacon the sugar plums danced in their heads. And Mama in her kerchief, and I in my cap, had just sat in our brains for a long little snap. When, out of the lawn there arose such a clatter, I sprang from my bed to see what was the matter. Away to the window I flew like a flash, all opened the shutters, flew up the sash. When, what to my wandering eyes should appear, for a miniature sleigh of eight tiny reindeer. With a little old driver so lively and quick, I knew in a moment it must be St. Nick. More rapid than eagles in the they came, and he whistled and shouted, he called the name, no matter how they first, no transfer and fiction, on from it, on Cupid, on Zander and fiction, to the top of the pot, to the top of the wall, no dash away, dash away, dash away all. So up to the house, up the quarters they flew, with a play for the time, and St. Nicholas too. As I blew in my head and was turning around, down the chimney St. Nicholas came with a bound. He was dressed all in fur, from his head to his foot, and his clothes were all tarnished with ashes and soot. A bundle of toys he had flung on his back, and he looked like a peddler just opening his pack. His eyes, how they twinkled, his dimples, how merry, his cheeks were like rosé, his nose like a cherry. His droll little mouth was drawn up like a bow, and the beard on his chin was as white as the snow. The stump of a pipe he held the tight of his teeth, and the smoke it encircled his head like a wreath. He had a broad face, and a little round belly that shook when he laughed like a bowl full of jelly. He was chubby and plump, a right jolly old elf, and I laughed when I saw it in spite of myself. He spoke not a word, but went straight to his work and filled all the stockings. Then turned with a jerk and laying his finger aside of his nose and giving a nod up the chimney he rose. He sprung to his play, to his team gave a whistle, and away they all flew like a sound of a fiddle. But I heard him exclaim ere he drove out of sight, Merry Christmas to all, and to all a good night. Good night.